Hey guys, it's Jasmine. So I just recorded this makeup look. Um, and I'm sorry for the music in the background. I forgot to turn it off before I start recording. But I just recorded this makeup trend and it's really just my it's called the like ox blood makeup trend. It's like a trend right now to have like ox looking <laughs> blood, like blood lipstick and a neutral eye and i just recorded this for you guys and i hope you guys enjoy and sorry for the music and the tv i'm really sorry but it's really just my neutral eye makeup and with just a little bit of variation and this red lipstick so i hope you guys enjoy love you hi hey guys it's jasmine and i'm here to show you this ox blood trend makeup and here i'm just priming my eyelids with the nyx HD primer and I'm putting that on my top and bottom lid and now I'm taking the NYX eyeshadow base in white and I'm just applying that on my lid as well And I'm going to take the Naked palette and take the color Buck with a blending brush and put that in my crease. And then I'm going to take my neutral, 28 color neutral bitch, party girl, I mean, <laughs> whoa, my neutral palette, the 28 neutral palette from Bitch Cosmetics, and I'm just taking that shade I showed you and putting that as my brow bone highlight, and my mom came in my room, and I'm talking to her, because she clearly didn't stop talking to me when she saw I was recording the video. Then I'm taking this shade in the neutral palette. And this is just a base color. I don't know why I decided to put that on there. But just to give it a little bit of a different look. Because the, these colors are not are not pigmented in the um in that palette. No, I don't really, I'm not a fan of the palette. So then I'm going to take Half Bake from the Naked palette and apply that over the color that I already put on. Just to lighten it up. Just to tie it so it's not as gold as it normally would be. And then I'm taking my beige party girl palette and mixing those two brown colors together and putting that in my outer corner, in my outer V and in my crease. And I'm using a base eyeshadow brush from Real Techniques. And I'm just making like a V shape, but you don't have to do that. And then I'm blending that out with a Coastal Scents Pro Blending Fluff. And then I'm taking the color Half Bake again and just putting some more because I lost some color. And then I'm taking my blending brush again and just blending that out. And I'm also going to add some more of the color Buck from the Naked palette from Urban Decay in my crease just to blend everything together. And I'm just blending the brown out a little bit more with the Pro Blending Fluff from Coastal Scent. And I think I added a little bit more brown there. And then I'm taking a C-shaped stiff brush and applying that brown color on my bottom lash line. 
and this brush is from Coastal Scents, but the e.l.f. one is just like that. Then I'm taking the color Sidecar from Urban Decay and a detailer brush from Real Techniques and putting that in my tear duct area. And I don't know if you can hear that noise, but somebody's faxing something in my house. So excuse that. And so I did my eyeliner, mascara, and stuff off camera, and now I'm going to do the lipstick, and I don't even know what I'm dancing to here. And I'm taking the NYX Lip Pencil and Plum and lining my lips and also fill them, filling them in slightly. And then I'm taking the Rimmel by Kate Moss, the Rimmel Kate Moss lipstick in the number 11, and it's just a dark red. I think it's a dupe for Mac Diva, I think it is, whichever the red one, the Rebel or Diva. I think it's Diva though. And it's just a really ox looking blood, you know, ox blood is like a try right now, so like a dark red color, which is cute. And that's the finished look, guys. I hope you enjoy, and please stay tuned for my next video. And don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Love you guys.